An explosion rocked in Imphal East Telepathy area. As per initial reports, at least one person is learned to have been injured in the explosion that occurred near the Mahavir Mandir area at Telepathy shortly before 9 pm. The injured has been identified as 23 year old Shubham Prasad. Bomb squad and personnel from the Parampat police station rushed to the spot after the incident. Meanwhile, Imphal East SP Maharbam Pradeep Singh, while speaking exclusively to Northeast Life, Chief of Bureau Arindam Das informed that the police has accessed at least three hours of CCTV footage till the blast to examine any suspicious movement. He said that the blast was triggered by an IED with no splinters, adding that the police received no intelligence inputs. SPM Pradeep Singh said that the Manipur, uh, poli Manipur police station has already launched an investigation into the matter. What is the information you have uh, got so far about what has happened? A blast at second place sometime around, uh, I think, 8 15. Okay. In a locality called Telepati. Okay. Now, this telepathy is actually, uh, you know, tele, no? It uh, relates with uh, tele. Okay, okay. The edible oil. Okay, yes, okay. Uh, they are uh, in, uh, settlers of Manipur uh, engaged in that kind of business. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, uh, there was one person in that. Okay. Uh, he's out of danger. Okay. Uh, and the, this one uh, is uh, intended to, like I always said, intended to make some noise okay. rather than uh, this one uh, uh, inflict okay. injury to people. Okay. So uh, that way, uh, this one is, uh, uh, we are taking the CCTV footage as to what happened and all that. Okay. But as of now, that is, it happened in a small gully, and then uh, the uh, our outpost or other deployment was also very close. Okay, uh, it was raining. It was raining, and the uh, uh, the uh, uh, public were very late on the road. Okay, okay. Mm. It looks like uh, <coughs> it looks like an IED. Without splinter. Okay. And uh, this one, uh, yeah, the police responded in time. Okay. And there was a little bit of a local mess, uh, a little agitated that the blast was second place in the locality. Okay. Now things have settled down. Okay. And uh, we are in the process of uh, investigation. Okay. So, so as you have mentioned that uh, you are examining, examining the CCTV footage, so were CCTV cameras uh, were there? Yes, 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 CCTV camera was there. Okay, and uh, the blast occurred in front of a temple also? It's actually at the site of a temple. I mean, uh, oh, the temple is very nearby. Okay. Uh, it's not exactly in front of the temple. The temple has a boundary, okay. and then uh, the blast took place in the boundary. And in opposite, there is one doctor also. Okay. Doctor Lalman Prasad, uh, medicine specialist. Okay. And uh, but uh, we are like, uh, I mean, like it will be too premature to confirm he targeted the doctor or targeted the mandir. Okay. Okay. Uh, because the Monday he would be right in the entrance, and uh, so he was running. Nobody was there. It could have been the entrance also, but it was not in the entrance either. Okay. It was a little away from the uh, Monday, and there was some vehicle parked, and then I think they have taken uh, advantage of the uh, set of the vehicle rather, okay. and so the vehicle bore the impact of the explosion. Okay. And uh, it is like that. There was no splinter, so I mean. It was not intended to hurt, I think it was intended to make a noise. You had any intelligence inputs that uh, such thing would happen? No intelligence input. Okay. But I don't know what will be revealed in the course of investigation. Okay. But uh, when it comes to trade or extortion, uh, no tangible or something that we can say is not there as of now. Uh, any needle of suspicion right now? No suspicion.
I as to regarding as to who would be responsible so the, no not that thing. I don't know who claims. Normally they claim in the news that I know. Okay. But as it's too premature to say that. So so far nobody has claimed it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And how are you going ahead with the investigation? We have taken the CCTV footage. We're okay. going to analyze it for the last three uh, hours before the explosion. We okay. see the movement of people around.